Hi there, is this Candace? Yes, it is. Well, hi, Candace. Hey, this is Dave and Angie at US 92. How are you doing this morning? Pretty good. Pretty good. And you're saying, okay, what's up here? <laughs> You wonder why we're calling? Maybe, perhaps. Yeah, just a little. Yeah, well, uh, let me let me uh, let your uh, mind wander here for a second. But I, I am going to go ahead and read you a little letter that we got that uh, we found to be uh, really awesome, and we'd like to share this with you. Okay. Uh, dear Dave and Angie, I would like to nominate three wonderful children from Plainview for your Christmas Wish program this year. They're 15-year-old Laredo, Lane is 12, and 10-year-old Logan. Over the past four years, I have grown to love these children as if they were my own niece and nephews. Just a year ago, their dad was diagnosed with stage four cancer, and they lost their father soon after that. Uh, Their mother has since remarried, and they have a wonderful, wonderful stepdad, but it's still a huge loss for them to be without their father. And these three kids are just absolutely the best of friends. And while they struggle with the the loss, they do act more like friends than siblings, and I find that to be absolutely amazing. They don't have many family members around the area, but I have become extremely close with their mother and in turn these three kids as well. I want them to have a wonderful Christmas and know that while their father may be gone, he is most definitely watching over them on a daily basis. And I wish that they find joy at Christmas and are able to celebrate the life of their father and to be able to have a little bit of fun. And this comes uh, with Merry Christmas wishes from Catherine Carlson. Wow. Well, first of all, let me ask how the kids are doing. Uh, they they seem to be uh, leaning on each other a lot, according to this letter, you know? They do. They're really, really close, and they have their days where, you know, it's not good, but they do really good. They're, they hold each other up. And that's that's absolutely amazing that kids, you know, they grow up a lot in a very short amount of time when things like this happen, it seems, don't you think? Yes, they do. Yeah, and, and although... Uh, we we just can't imagine what they're going through inside. We hope that uh, this will make them stronger. We know that they're going to be incredible adults, and, and uh, down the road they're going to look back on things, and, uh, you know, they will definitely have um, great life memories with their dad, and that's what they're going to lean on throughout. And as they move forward in uh, the day-to-day, we know that um, there's nothing anybody can do to, to make anything change or uh, change the situation that uh, is currently here. But having people like uh, your friend Catherine definitely, Definitely makes it, you know, make you know that that you got friends that love you out there, and there's a lot of people to be back you up and support you during oh, these yeah. times, you know. And uh, with that said, we got some Christmas wish elves that have uh, been working hard in the background, and they've been busy shopping, as a matter of fact, for uh, your wonderful kids. Okay. And we thought we might uh, give them a little extra Christmas cheer just to let them know that there's other people out there that uh, love them and support them. And, and you know, it's uh, from people you don't even know, our good friends Randy and Lori Ortwick, they wanted to go do some shopping. And they found uh, found your story to be very near and dear to their hearts because Randy, a good friend of mine, um, has many times uh, talked about uh, the story of losing his father at a very, very young age. And so this this definitely touched him greatly. And so we know that Laredo loves being creative. And oh, so yeah. so we have some amazing art supplies and cool things so she can go let her creativity just explode and just just have a ton of fun. And for the boys, Lane and Logan, we got some games and some controllers for the Wii. And we don't want to say everything because we want it all to be kind of a surprise. So, okay. but it's everything's all wrapped, so they have to open it. Okay. Okay. But uh, but just some fun stuff, just to let them know that uh, we're proud of them for uh, what they have done and uh, and come through over the course of this last year and all the changes in their lives and things. And and uh, we just want them. To to know that uh, Christmas should be a time to celebrate, and uh, we are very, very fortunate to be able to do it here with the Christmas Wish Program this morning, okay? Okay, well, thank you very much. Well, listen, thank you, Candace, and, and hang on for me just a second. We'll get you some details on how we're going to get these gifts to you, but uh, please, uh, on behalf of all of us here at US 92, Randy and Lori and everyone involved here, uh, we want to wish you and your family a very good Christmas, and uh, we hope you'll find good time to celebrate this year, okay? All right, thank you.